hello everyone welcome to the channel i am abhijit and today in this video i will tell you how to add values to opportunity stage pick list in salesforce so in salesforce opportunity stage values are the pick list field with values these stages are considered steps that are taken by the user to define the current status of the sales of a product or a service and also salesforce have some inbuilt opportunity stage values that fill the requirements of the sales process some of these values are prospecting qualification need analysis closed win etc uh, so in this video we are going to discuss about the adding values to opportunity stage pick list value in the both versions of salesforce that is salesforce lightning and salesforce classic so first we are going to discuss about the process of adding values to opportunity stage pick list value in salesforce lightning so let's move ahead and see the process in lightning so right now i am on the setup page of salesforce lightning and here click on this object manager tab which is near the home tab and in the object manager you can see the list of objects and from this list we have to find the object opportunity and you can find this object from directly from the quick find box or just by scrolling so here is the object opportunity so click on this and in the object opportunity go to the detail section and click on this fields and relationships and in the fields and relationships you can see the items sorted by the field label and here is scroll down and in the bottom you can see this field label stage with the pick list data type click on the stage and in the opportunity stage pick list values section you can see these are the stage values and to create a new opportunity stage value click on this new button and in this step we are going to enter the required details to create this new opportunity stage value so in the stage name i am going to enter the name of this uh, stage value and i am naming it as a develop proposal and in the probability field you have to add the percentage of this stage value and i have added the percentage as a 75 percent and now after adding a stage name and probability click on this save button and you can see this develop proposal is now in the list of opportunity stage pick list values and now we are going to assign this newly created stage value to a sales process and for that we will go back to the setup page and in the quick find box search for sales processes and in the drop down you can see this option sales processes click on this and in this window select the sales process in which you have to assign this uh, stage value and in case you haven't created a sales process then you have to click on this new button and uh, enter the required fields and click on the save button since i have already created this sales process so i will assign this value in this sales process so click on this process name so this is the stage value develop proposal which i have created right now now i will select it and with the help of this add button i will add it to the section of selected values and click on save button now this value is assigned to this sales process and now to check whether this stage value is assigned to this sales process or not so we will go to the opportunity and for that go to the sales application and in sales application go to this opportunity tab you can see this stage column and when you click on this pencil icon and now click on this drop down and we can see this is the stage value which we have assigned so in this way we add opportunity stage pick list value in salesforce lightning now we will see the same process in salesforce classic and to switch to the classic version you have to click on this view profile and in the drop down click on the switch to salesforce classic and now on the home page of salesforce classic click on this setup tab and on the setup page of salesforce classic go to the left sidebar and in the build section click on this customize drop down and here click on the drop down of this opportunities object and in the opportunities click on these fields and in the opportunity standard fields you can see this field level stage so click on the stage and in the opportunity field stage go to the section opportunity stage pick list value where you can see the stage values and to create a new stage value click on this new button and in the stage name section and in the stage name section uh, enter the name of the stage value and in the probability field we have to enter the percentage of this stage value so i have named this stage value as a client presentation and the probability percentage i have kept 75 and after adding the name and probability click on the save button 
and now you can see this value client presentation is added in the opportunity stages picklist values now we will assign this stage value to the sales process and for that go to this quick find box and search sales processes and now click on the sales processes under the heading opportunities and in the sales processes select the sales process in which you, you have to assign this value so there is a sales process named opportunity process in which i am going to assign this created value so i will click on this opportunity process and here you can see the two columns available values and selected values and in the available values section you can see this newly created stage value client presentation so i will select it and with the help of this add button i will add it to the section of selected values and now i will click on the save button so right now the stage values is being assigned to the sales process and now we are going to check whether the stage value is being assigned or not and for that we will go to this opportunities tab and from here select any opportunity and in the opportunity detail section click on this edit button and on the right hand side you can see this stage field and click on this drop down of this stage field you can see the newly created value client presentation is visible along with other stage values so this is how we add opportunity stage pick list value in salesforce classic so this was all about adding opportunity stage pick list value and assigning them in the sales processes and i hope that you have liked this video then please do like share and subscribe us and do not forget to hit the bell icon so that you can get regular updates of our upcoming videos and thank you for giving your time and watching this video till last see you in the next video till then goodbye